I think Ugandans are interested in looking at pictures of homosexuals. <laughs> yes, yeah, this is the one that called for hang them here. We are quoting a church leader who called for the hanging of homosexuals. So we are not telling people to hang. <laughs> no, in Uganda, people do not hang. They are very, it's government that does that. You see here, this is a lesbian. Even this one. Hmm? I just would like to know in which country this film has always uh, already been seen and mm -hmm. if it's uh, participating in some film uh, festival. Um, it's actually been in a lot of festivals, like over 150 festivals. It has been kind of all over the world at this point, including all over Africa, which is um, an important element of us. So it's played, you know, in, um, in Kenya, in Ethiopia, Nigeria, Uganda, uh, South Africa, uh, all over the place. When you look at it, wind could throw me. Wind would really blow me. It was very thin. People don't want to know our stories. That's one reason I decided to come out, no matter what. In December, the law was passed, and the president refused to sign. How do you how do you see that? What what, what do you think is going on? Um, I think what it shows, though, is this continuing um, kind of to and fro between this idea of like what we want to do in our country and what the rest of the world is telling us to do. I don't think Museveni cares that much about gay rights. I don't think his as vehemently against it as a lot of the anti-gay pastors, for example. But it's not as if he's vetoing it because he really wants them to live a great, happy life. He's vetoing it because he's afraid of um, foreign aid being suspended and a lot of other things um, falling to pieces because of it. Contestant number one, Veronica. Ancora di più, e soprattutto a questo paese, che bisogna stare molto attenti quando si confonde la religione con la politica. We are going to crown this country 2010-2011. I hope it becomes an annual event. This is crazy, He wants to steal the crown. 